Hi, this is Keith Fredericks coming to you from General 3D in New York. And I'm going to demonstrate the 3D feed driver for the NVIDIA 3D Vision system. First, I'm downloading the setup program. And uh, okay, and we're going to run the setup program. Okay, and while I'm uh, running this, I'll tell you uh, what I'm running on here is the new Toshiba A665 with NVIDIA uh, 3D Vision, which includes the glasses here and a built-in IR transmitter in the, uh, directly in a laptop. Now, I've downloaded this using Internet Explorer, and I've already downloaded Firefox. Firefox 4 Beta 7. And right now, I'm going to select then, since I have already installed the the new frame sequential mode driver from General 3D and 3D Feed, I'm going to select the frame sequential mode on the 3D Feed preferences page. And then I'm going to go to uh, videos. And now I should be able to turn on my 3D vision glasses. And they're on. And let's select this video here. And detach. I restart the browser after having installed the application. Okay, and now it is actually already going into the three mode. in the NVIDIA 3D Vision mode, playing a file from 3dfeed.tv. And I'm seeing this in full stereoscopic 3D. Now, I'll take this out of this mode by pressing Alt-Escape. It takes it down to Windowed mode, which currently uh, is uh, under development. Put it in pause, and let's select another video. Let's select this thing. Okay, and as you could see, if you're watching, it actually, the flashing was taking it into the NVIDIA mode. And this is another cool 3D video. 
Let's do that again, just so that you can see it. Stop the video in the windowed mode. And let's go to another video. Live streaming. Watch. Okay, so there you go. See the decrease in brightness and the flicker. That's where it's going into the NVIDIA mode. And that is the Alpha 3D feed driver from General 3D. using the Toshiba A655 and I'm Keith Fredericks coming to you again from General 3D in New York and I'll see you next time.